Hello, welcome to Spurred On, and this is part two of Spurverse. Uh, I'm Rhys James, I'm here with Craig Much, am I saying that right? No, you're not. Well, let's see what they say in the comments. Anyway, this week we are extremely excited about the new stadium. Oh, Cash yeah. money coming to us through this stadium. Uh, first of all, it is capacity of 61,000, which is <laughs> bigger than Arsenal Stadium. <laughs> Unlucky. Arsenal? Biggest stadium in North London. Are you right in thinking it's the biggest club stadium in it, London? You are, you're right. Second biggest right. in the whole of the Premiership. Ha <laughs> you've been leaving Arsenal. You have. Also, the NFL pitch that we were worried about last week, uh, messing up our pitch, turns out it's going to be retractable. We don't have to worry about that Ooh, stuff. And about we got a minimum of two NFL games played on our pitch for the next 10 years, per year that is, which means cash money. We can spend that on all sorts of players, all sorts of stuff, maybe Kevin Morales, who knows. Uh. Go back and watch part one if you don't understand what I'm talking about. Um, <laughs> also suggest that we're going to get a franchise and play much more and become so rich that we can buy Hazard and officially become Belgium for good. That's cool. I, I just that. want Arabs to come in. Just Arabs, come buy us. Just one of you airlines, Qatar Airways, anyone, just come. I don't want to be part of this whole American franchise. I just want Arabs to come buy us. We can be the new Man City and we can laugh at Arsenal for the next 30 years. But why, why are you so anti-America? I'm not anti-America. I, I, anti I, just, I just think... Arabs are more frivolous with their money, so come oh, on, be frivolous, wow. do it. Well, I don't know. I like I like the Yankee dollar personally. Okay. Uh, also, we've got a skywalk on top of the stadium, which yeah. means that you can, uh, as part of the tour, you can walk on top of it. Mm. How do you feel about that? Pretty Good. Interesting. Yeah, we can, you know, see how Tottenham's been uh, gentrified. You know, we can have a look yeah. at all the nice new buildings. They are going to make the area nice, mm. which is necessary. Yeah. I don't know if you've been to White Hart Lane recently, but uh, yeah. it's not. Just nice make sure you keep chicken. Nice chicken, area. don't go, please. Which, I need your chicken, just don't. Which one? Which place? Chicken Cottage? No, the chicken. Jerk chicken. 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 I thought you were just saying chicken. No, chicken. Make sure you keep chicken in Tottenham. Man. <laughs> um, also having the world's tallest indoor climbing centre. Yeah. So it's basically becoming an extreme sports centre. Uh, in case you want to, you know, relatively kill yourself. Relatively cool. It kind of reminds me of when they, like, re built the, the PE room at my school, oh. so I'm not that excited about it. Uh, um, yeah, I, I won't be climbing up there. I'm ignoring your comment about killing yourself, by the way, because <laughs> I feel like it's quite a sensitive issue. Okay. <laughs> um, but good, it's good that they're making it more desirable, yeah, 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 yeah. because we are becoming a much bigger club. We've and got also, hotels out there as well, apparently, as well. Two yeah, tall hotels. Yeah, going to need it for all the bloody Arabs you're bringing over, mate. Yeah, seven star, um, apparently. Take them to Chick King if you want. I don't mm. know. Uh, is that? I oh, forget it. Uh, I was about to say something. Oh, <laughs> moving on. We got, the, we got the pre seasons going well. We beat Southend 4 0 in a kind of behind closed doors match, and we were wearing the purple kit, I think. Yeah. Maybe it was a training kit. Purple training kit, not a third strip. 4 0. Ben Taleb scored a screamer, mm -hmm. which you can see on the Spurs official channel. Uh, are you subscribe sure, to this one first. Are you sure it was behind closed doors? Or just South Southend just don't have fans? Like, they just have a Yeah, small, maybe tiny they just stadium. couldn't bring anyone. Yeah, I mean, it's South End. I don't think anyone supports South End. But I don't know if we had any fans there either. I mean, the best thing to come out of South End is uh, that amazing amusement park they have. I love it, Adventure Island. If you haven't been, go. There you go. If you do want to give us a sponsorship deal, Adventure Island, we are all ears. Ooh. We would love it. Yeah, we'll have it printed across the. Yeah, 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 no yeah, way. Yeah, Adventure yeah. Island, amazing. Um, <laughs> <laughs> also, we've got the All Star game coming up where we play the MLS All Stars. Oh, yeah. That features Robbie Keane, your oh, favourite player. Yeah. Uh, probably best player, you were saying best striker Spurs I've ever had, weren't you? Anyway, yeah. something like that. Uh, also, Gerard, also Kaka. So, we're going to play them 29th of July in Denver. How do you think we're going to get on? Do you think we're going to smash them? Yeah, there has been. You know, us, are. amazing young players with all the potential you. in the world, versus has been. Like Gerard, who's never ever won a Prem title. Robbie Keane, who's never won a Prem title. Kaka, who just is mean, injury prone. No I need mean, to still yeah. slag off Robbie King. I mean, no, I like Robbie King. Check yes, out the yeah. 8 bit debate, though. Yeah, there's some interesting yeah, points out. made, and it gets pretty dark pretty quickly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, you keep getting mentioned. It's very strange. <laughs> anyway, this has been Spurverts Part 2. Thank you for watching. Make sure to like the video if you liked it, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and follow us on Twitter at Spurred on TV. <laughs>